So what do we have here? It's a music box. Hmm. No. 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 As you can no. see, this <laughs> you can see that. As you can see, that's a no button, and I have plans for it. So when I was in school, I had to endure the French lessons. There was a pretty, pretty there was a special sentence uh, that we've learned first. It was something like, Et boom, le choc. and I want to add some parts. <laughs> to that button to make a no! a boom sell shock button. I'm gonna use some parts for that. We'll probably use one of those mp3 thingies. There will be something that's controlling it and for that I'm gonna maybe take an AT tiny or find another Arduino or something. Why don't we start with opening the button? No, 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 no. <laughs> Shut up. Okay, so the first thing let's take up the batteries and there must be screws yep there are screws it's probably the first thing you have to look when you have something like this like those rubber feeds you have to remove them and then you'll see that you have some screws in there okay oh that's a monster speaker that's the squishy part interesting sorry for Okay, this board is <laughs> no screws there, um, so it's molten plastic all the way. So we have to break that off. Too bad there's not a good structure, support structure. Uh, I want to reuse the batteries. Uh, maybe I need to use a booster to make things easier. We we'll probably use one of those USB booster packs. There's not much to it. It's probably a chip that you, does everything. Um, I'm gonna remove the plastic pins now. Okay. Yeah, there's nothing on the back side. Really a one chip solution where this one plies everything uh, there's on it. After I took everything apart, I've um, breadboarded something on my new shiny pink, pinkish <laughs> breadboard. This is an AT Tiny 85 and a DF Robot MP3 player module. And there's an MP3 on there. Um, that will sound something like this. Et boom, le shock. This works like this when you reset Et the boom, button. Le shock. The AT Tiny. It will start the MP3 module and then um, we'll play the sound and then we'll um, put the DF robot MP3 player module into sleep and then put itself into sleep again. And the button that will be here will reset the AT Tiny. And the reset will then wake up the AT Tiny again. So there's a little delay, like around one second before it starts. Um, Et boom, le shock. I have no idea how to make that any faster because it's actually the MP3 player that takes a while to start up. You can sometimes hear that the sample starts a bit weird, like there's an yeet. That's probably due to the waking and sleeping routine. So next up will be, I will put everything into a smaller form factor and probably put the original PCB back in and just use the switch. That should be plenty. Booster. 
Uh, I've prepared the USB booster ones. Um, so I don't really need the USB port. Left one is negative. This one is minus. This one is plus. Come on. There we go. Why is this so annoying? Okay. Ground. Ground. VCC. VCC. RX. And that should be TX. And the reset button. That should be that. Um, maybe it's a good idea to remove the LED. Come on. Okay. Hmm. Should I remove the ship? It shouldn't explode. Uh. Next I will wire up the um, reset button, the button for the AT Tiny, and we'll see if this works. I've decided to make a little board with a dip thingy. Just an adapter, so maybe I can recycle the AT Tiny for something else. And what I've done here is um, I've took an old perf board, just cut off a bit and then tried to remove the oxidation from the copper pads with sandpaper and it worked quite well actually. So that's data and that went to pin 3. So let's do that now. Okay, let's remove the programming cable and just solder of the resistor straight to the module. Next up is data, blue one, data. And that was that. This is what I want to use for reset. This would be ground. So let's solder this to ground. Which is actually pretty nice because now I can use this tab for the other ground connection. So let's fix up ground. Sorry if the colors confuse you a bit. I'm just going with what I have because why not? This is ground and ground is that pin which is also shield so that shouldn't be problematic. That needs to go here because the other one has power. I need to be sort of to... Okay, that's the reset line. <laughs> While we're at it, let's remove the LED here. Well, we don't need an LED here. It's in the case anyway, so it will only take battery power. This is power. Okay, now we have a bigger attack point for the second power line we need. Because this one isn't connected yet. Sanity check. Yeah, this is there, this goes there. Reset. Right. Let's put this one in. And the battery. Uh, let's see if everything works or if it starts smoking. Nope. Let's get a multimeter. Okay. <laughs> Here's the mistake already, isn't it? This is plus. Minor whoopsie. So I think what happened here is that I've messed up the connections. This is ground and this is plus. So hopefully I didn't grill everything. Now this one will go here. 
want to fill this one will go here. Awesome. Let's try that one more time. No, nothing is smoking. So let's test voltages if nothing works. Okay, they are perfectly fine. Three volts sounds fine. Five volts, okay. Five volts, okay. What's the voltage level on reset? 2.2. 2.2 is weird. Let's remove the chip. I'm going to cut off the legs. It's a bit sad, but you probably can. And you can buy this wherever you want for around $4, so it shouldn't be too bad. Let's remove the legs. I think that should be it. So let's turn it on again. Et boom, c'est le choc. That's what I wanted to hear. Et boom, c'est le choc. <laughs> okay, this needs to fit back in again, and that shouldn't be much of a hassle. Screw post here. Let's grab the heat gun. <laughs> oh no, the heat gun. <laughs> that should have stayed there. Oops. Forgot that it's live. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> what a mess. Let's try to pull it back together like this. Right? Tricky to get it close again. Okay, here we go. Big presentation. Et boom, c'est le choc. Et boom, c'est le choc. Et boom, c'est le choc. <laughs> awesome. Et boom, c'est le choc. Okay, let's see if I can measure the Standby current. Uh, how do I do that? Let's start with milliamps. Et boom, c'est le choc. Well, that's not so good. 40 milliamps. Let's say that's four hours on a 160 milliamp battery. So it probably makes sense to um, figure out if um, there's a. A better solution when it comes to um, current consumption. Et boom, le choc. I wouldn't mind if this is just U USB powered, then you can basically let it run from a small USB charger. But in general, it's pretty neat to have a button like this. It's me, uh, the whitest boy alive. I had some fun with this project, I must say. Um, there's probably a ton of stuff that I can do differently and there are a lot of tutorials out there to make sound with an Arduino or with an ATtiny by itself, um, playing stuff from the from another RAM chip uh, over SPI, I think. And there's also the 4chan um, version where you can just play sound from the SD card with an ATtiny. That's pretty neat. If you like the project, please leave a comment about how I look or a wedding proposal in the comments. Wait, no, I'm not a girl.
what's what's salty leave a comment um, if you have another idea how you could um, create something like this uh, if you ever have created something like this share and maybe maybe there are people out there that write really good tutorials this is just a project that i've made for myself i will leave the links that were most helpful for this project in the comment uh, not in the comments in the description you will never find them and probably ask me in the comments about them because no one reads the descriptions what would you put on a button like this uh, would you add more samples uh, which 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 what would you do just tell me in the comments <laughs> so this is how youtube works if you like the video there's a thumbs up button then you can thump it down i don't care well i care Everyone cares. What am I doing? I'm filming like two two minutes outro right now. Bye guys. Damn it. Bye people.